You concerned parents met with the Cardinal Newman principal this morning to talk about the videos and how they were addressed. News 19's Nick Jones has that part of the story tonight. Pretty disturbed about it, pretty traumatized, and he feels uncomfortable being around, uh, you know, people that, you know, he really doesn't know how they feel. Devlon Porter, a parent of a student at Cardinal Newman and his family, are shocked after watching racist videos from a now former student at the school. He says his son never thought this would be an issue at his school. He's never received any kind of signs of any kind of racism or anything like that, so this is something that comes as a uh, definite shock to him. On Monday, parents say they had a meeting with the principal to talk about their concerns and find more answers. We went in looking for answers and actually found out we were left with more unanswered questions. Uh, why they wouldn't tell us, you know, prior to now, prior to this past weekend, I do not know. In the two-hour meeting, Porter felt the school wasn't being completely transparent. He believes the situation needs to be taken more seriously because of what could have happened to the kids. Any one of these days could have been his last if that student would have came up here and executed his plan. Dylan Roof made the same kind of videos prior to his shooting, said the exact same type of things, and we see what happened there. Why should we sleep on this? Other parents at the school who didn't want to go on camera say they feel Cardinal Newman has handled this situation appropriately. They believe the administration did the right thing by notifying police the day they found out about it and banning the student from the property. Porter still believes Cardinal Newman is a great school, but everyone needs to figure out how to move forward from here. Be transparent in the future so that we can move forward together and solve this issue. Uh, we definitely uh, want you to be more open and not hold secrets from us that can endanger our children's lives. In Columbia, Nick Jones, News 19, WLTX.